Welcome back Freedom Savers. This one's going to be the fastest update ever. This is my brand new portfolio. It's the newest, latest, greatest, and hopefully last one for a while. Um, this is going to be the no rules portfolio. This portfolio, literally, I am not applying any rules to it at all. I can do whatever I want in this portfolio. And this is my free for all portfolio. So if I feel that I want to invest in GE, then I'll invest in GE, which I'm not doing by the way. Um, if I feel Apple's on sale, I'll buy Apple. If I just want to experiment and buy super high yielding dividend ones that I would not put in any of the other categories or portfolios, I'll throw them in here. Um, in the meantime, while I'm not, while I don't have any particular plans for this portfolio, I'm not planning on selling. You know, I am a long-term investor. When I buy something, I'm not planning on selling it. I'm planning on keeping it. But with that said, I may throw some growth stocks in here as well. And growth stocks are meant to be sold once you make a profit. So those I would probably sell if I made over 20% profit. Or I just felt that they were coming to their cap. I don't know. I can't time the damn market. I'm probably going to be a bad growth investor. I probably would just invest for long term and just leave them and forget them. But anyways, long story short, it's a no rules portfolio. I'll throw whatever the hell I want in here, do whatever I want, and it's just there for that. For now, I only have the VU in there. If you don't know what VU is, it is a, the Vanguard S&P 500 uh, ETF. It tries to follow the, the S&P 500's performance to the best of its abilities. Um, the great thing about this particular ETF, which I do recommend to beginners, is that the expense ratio is super low at 0.04%. So I just threw a, the initial 100 bucks into this account because when you open a taxable account on M1, you do have to deposit $100. So I deposited the original 100 bucks in here and that was just today. And today's rally, of course, already got me a little profit as it is up to $100.61. So there's nothing really to see here. The value is 161. I deposit 100, I'm up 61 cents, which is of course 0.61%. There's no dividends, of course. Of course, there's no dividend changes. Yearly, this right now, just a VU, it has a yield of 2.23 right now with the current price. Uh, my yield on cost is 2.24%. It will now currently produce $2.24 per year or 19 cents per day. Um, we will be continuing to contribute to this one. I believe I've set up a fund for this. Yes, I did. We'll be depositing $25 every week on Thursday into this. Now, I won't necessarily be auto investing straight into VU or anything else. I may or may not do that. I may just hold some cash in here. And then when I do have something I want to do, I'll just automatically invest that cash. Or I may just let it auto invest in VU until I decide to do something and just auto invest from there the 25 a week. We shall see. Currently, I have auto invest on, so for now it'll go into view unless I change my mind by next week when it gets deposited. So it's a no rules portfolio. There's no rules. What else can I say? We will be continually depositing to it and doing updates on it, though. So you can keep tuned on that. All right, guys. So that this is my last portfolio update for this week, and I wanted to give you a heads up that I will be moving my portfolio updates most likely to Sunday instead of Friday. Um, I apologize for that, but my work schedule is changing and Sunday will be my day off. Whereas Friday is definitely not my day off. And having time to do updates on six different portfolios every Friday after I work 10, after I work 10 to 11 hours a day is not going to be an easy thing to accomplish. So I will probably still try to get updates out on Friday, but I'm not promising that. I'm going to promise every all the updates will be out by Sunday. If I can do some updates on Friday after the market closes and I get home from work, I will. If not, then I'll try to do the same thing on Saturday after work. And if not, then it'll be Sunday. If I get some out on Friday and Saturday, then I'll put the rest out on Sunday. So my portfolio updates for the six different portfolios I have will all come out between Friday and Sunday every single week. So stay tuned for that. And again, if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me. If you like my videos, hit the like button. We're doing some crazy portfolios here. We're doing some different investing strategies to see how they play out over 2019. So hopefully this is something that you can learn from or at least be entertained by my stupidity of doing this. All right, guys, that's all I got. I hope you are having a great week. 
and hope you have a great weekend. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And if you liked the video, hit that like button for me. Um, if you want to hear any specific type of information, anything that you're interested in, you have any questions, just drop me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know your opinions on this video or any other video I've made. And if you know anyone else that might be interested in this video, please be sure to share it on your social media and share the knowledge. Thanks, guys.